all right y'all i'm back with another sponsored video from i like hair so shout out to them for sending me this wig so i'm just showing you the goodies that come with the wig so we got some wig caps they sent me this little package here with some clips an edge brush and a elastic band and a clip with their uh, name on it and as you can see this wig construction comes with uh, the clips, comes with an adjustable, removable band in the back, which I love. It's great for security. And here's the wig. It's already pre-cut. It is a 4x4 closure, but as you can see, I'm showing you guys what that lace kind of looks like. And I love the layers on this wig. It is layered to the gods, honey. So you guys, excuse my hair, y'all. <laughs> child my bear my hair will barely stay in braids because y'all know i have a pixie cut and it's growing back from the pixie and i just been wearing wigs because i haven't got a chance to get my hair done but i'm just using this sephora powder uh it's a microfiber foundation powder and i'm using that in the color mahogany to cover the lace and i just went ahead and popped this bad boy on and as you guys can see it's so cute it's so it's giving me like 70s like almost like wolf cut vibes and i really really like it this wig is super soft it didn't have a smell to it um and it says uh they were gonna send me the 12 inch but i think they sent me a six i think this is a 16 or 18 i forgot um i'll leave it linked in the description for you guys but I love these layers and how they're falling. Um, I was thinking about cutting them a little bit just because they were like too, too in my face. But I wound up not cutting them. But as you can see, look at that lace, y'all. Look at that lace. Come on. So we're, we're going to do this glueless today because um, um, I've had enough glue and things on my head. I'm not even going to use a spray. This is going to be 100% glueless, sprayless, all that. Y'all know I got to keep my water. Stay hydrated. <laughs> but... Yes, so I just love, look at just how it's falling um, on the sides. Like, it is so cute. Like, uh, they really did a great job layering this wig. Um, so I'm just using my Not Doctor uh, from Conair. And I'm using that on high heat to just flip the bangs a little bit. Um, and this is a great wig to use uh i mean a great tool to use with a wig like this because it helps give you the like blowout look so that's what i wound up doing with this i didn't do too too much because honestly it was already bomb the way they had it i just wanted to enhance it a little bit more um so i just took random pieces and curled them in different ways and just enhanced the layering a little bit i didn't do too too much though um i wouldn't recommend using a flat iron um but you could i would say using a roller brush with a blow dryer or a tool like this would be better because it gives you more of a fluffy look and i like the messier look like not so uniform so this worked out better for me but you could use a flat iron to get the same effect um i couldn't find my um my clips that i use for my bangs when i do curtain bangs my um no band clips i don't know where they were at at this time but i think we made it work but y'all look get into these layers honey i'm loving these layers and this is definitely one of those wear and go wigs you really you don't even have to put concealer in the part or do any of that you could literally just pop this wig on and go um but i'm just placing some concealer in that part just to define it a little bit more and then honestly i'm just playing around with it just seeing how i want it to lay and i didn't want it to be super flat so i took my hands up to kind of tease it a bit just to give it a little bit more volume but overall i love this wig i'm loving the bangs i love how they sit it's giving me like 70s like and y'all know this curtain bang layered look is coming back into style and overall i really just think this is a great wig basically wound up this was like a week or so later i basically wound up washing the wig and as you can see it's very very flat but i want to show you guys how you can get some volume back in the wig after you wash it um 
So here's what I did. I took my knot doctor and I basically was going through the wig and trying to like dry roll it like through. I think this would have worked out a little bit better if the hair was wet or if it was some kind of product on it to help it kind of form with the heat from the blow dryer. But not to worry, when in doubt, you can use a flat iron. So <laughs> I'm kind of here trying to give it some more volume and it's just not looking how I want it to look. But I wanted to add this part in the video anyway to show you guys that it's not always easy to achieve the look that you want. Sometimes you have to put in a little bit of work but I wanted to show you guys that you can get there. So I was feeling the messy look a little bit, but I was like, you know what? Let me just go ahead and use my flat iron to give it a little bit more volume and make it a little bit more, uh, not uniform, but give the curls a bit more direction, but still give like a cute, messy curtain bang kind of look. So what you guys see me doing here is just, I'm literally taking random pieces the wig is already layered so i'm basically just grabbing random pieces and curling them forward backwards just to give the wig some dimension and to help add some volume so you guys are going to see me here throughout the rest of this video basically uh curling pieces of the wig some forward some backwards um some i'm just bumping simply not even curling just to give the wig a little bit of uh, dimension as I already said but yeah I love the way this turned out and it's just to show you guys that even when it's time to wash the wig and you want to restyle it you can still get a dope look from it and it doesn't look exactly the same as it did in the first clip but it does have a ton of volume and it's so pretty with these curls I'm loving it it's really giving me like a 70s like disco soul train like vibe i don't know i'm just really loving it but this is just so you guys can see that you can still style the wig to your liking and make it look super cute with lots of volume and get lots of wears out of it so once again shout out to i like hair for sending me this wig i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next one